From unspeakable barely surviving to cash ending up in the ER, these are the 13 craziest accidental injuries in YouTube videos. You don't want to miss what happened to unspeakable, so make sure you keep watching until the end. Number 13, Jelly. We're starting this one off light, but as the video goes on, these continue to get crazier and crazier. But we have Jelly here and he's on a roller coaster when he literally hits his head. This is insane and seriously could have been really bad. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Did you hear that? He literally hit his head on the ride. We now get to see the aftermath and let's see how Jelly's feeling. Number 12. We now have this YouTuber who thought it'd be a good idea to jump into someone else's backyard in their pool. Like they literally jumped the fence and jumped in their pool. Little did they know, the homeowner was actually waiting for them and what happens is insane. And if you think that sounds crazy, you will not believe Wapit's unspeakable, so stay tuned. It's already open. So this YouTuber is sneaking into a random person's backyard right now and is about to jump in their pool. <laughs> right now, the homeowner is literally freaking out and begins chasing them. It gets intense. The homeowner is literally chasing after the YouTuber right now. Get in the car, get in the freaking car, go, 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 go. Bro, get out of here, let's go, dude, come on, go. The car just didn't start. Go, 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 bro. Okay, go, 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 don't hit nobody. Number nine, make jugger nuggets. Make jugger nuggets crashes his car. He recently brought a brand new car and invited his friend Lance Stewart to test it with him. And Nuggets was really happy with this car and got too excited, started swerving, and eventually lost control of the car and they crashed. This isn't good. 60! Alright. Here we go, dude. I'm popping up the bus. Here we go. I'm racing. Yo, 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 yo! yo! the last time that I looked down at the speedometer, it said around 65, 70 miles per hour. Um, I reached down to make it look like I was flipping a switch to activate nitrous. Um, and then I heard Lance scream and I looked up and I saw we were going into the oncoming lane. Right now he continues to tell a story and gets really emotional. Man, I actually feel bad for McJugger Nuggets. <laughs> And at that point in time, I flew on the brakes and turned the wheel to avoid it. And I overcompensated too much. And then we were heading off the road. So I cut the wheel back again. But once again, I got really scared. And at this point, um, we're both screaming and I cut the wheel a little too hard and I cut into the grass of somebody's property. The car then, for, and, and mind you, the camera literally got rocked. It, it went, it launched across the car. Number eight, Mad Maxi. Rad actually crashed his motorbike. So R Maxi was racing with his friend Rad who lost control of his bike and crashed on the track. This is an absolutely crazy clip, but thankfully Rad had a full recovery and is back on his feet today. <laughs> Okay? 
hell, Rowdy, okay? I'm done. Number seven, Cash and Maverick. Cash hurts his neck. Cash and Maverick were recording a video when they were learning a backflip, but it took a turn for the worse during one of Cash's attempt, and he actually ended up landing on his head, and it hurt his neck really bad. Guys, this is insane. But if you think this sounds crazy, you will not believe what happens unspeakable. Keep watching. Three, two, What's wrong? I can't do it. I just can't do it. All right, ready? Ready, guys? Prepared, bro. All right, three, two, one. Oh, 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 oh. oh my god. Is it your neck? Dude, what yeah. do we do? Did you snap your neck? Oh my god. Bro, go get the ambulance. Go, go, go get the ambulance. Go. My phone, where's my phone? Where's my phone? No, it's part of the Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Fancy can get in the car, so we're just gonna take it to the. The ambulance is like a lot of money, so we're just gonna try to take it. It's locked. Get the keys, get the keys, get the keys, get the keys! Mm. Bro, you're gonna be okay, you're gonna be okay, you're gonna be okay. Oh God, where's your keys? I don't know. Uh, yeah. I'm not gonna be able to. Right now, Maverick picks up cash from the hospital, and you can see what went down. Aw, oh, I'm so glad he's okay to this day, though. <laughs> uh, I guess we just wait. Yeah, we'll just wait and see. Hopefully, he gets out of here soon. Um, hold on. Hey, buddy. How you feeling, champ? What'd they say? Like, is it broken or anything? Like, yeah, dude. What do you, what do you, obviously, they said just to take it easy and to... Number six, Ali A. This year is so sad. So Ali A got into a car crash. This crash was pretty serious and it actually destroyed Ali A's dream car that he spent so much money on. Luckily though, he's okay, but the car, not so much. The important part is that Ali A is okay though. Just wait till you see how bad the car is. Ali A has footage from the crash. Drove for a few hours to where I was gonna be doing filming. Filmed all day to about 7, 8 p.m. Then had a meeting after that. And then it came to about 10 p.m. It was time for me to drive home and this is where the mistakes were made. I was stupidly tired. I've not felt that tired in goodness knows how long. It was stupidly dark and the roads that I was about to drive on were country roads that I'd never been on before. And 30 seconds into setting off, started playing some music, trying to wake myself up. I took literally two turns and then I misjudged a turn hit the curb and crash. Right now, Ali A shows the footage of the car and man, this is sad to see. Ali A worked so hard for this car and it is now gone. My R8, the black R8 that you guys will have known and will have seen in many, many videos. Now, why didn't I tell you guys about this earlier? Obviously I was devastated. They got out of the car. I, I couldn't believe what had just happened. It took several days, which to be honest, I still can't believe it happened. And I just looked at it being like, please, please, please be fixable, be drivable, and getting out the car, it clearly wasn't drivable. When I hit the curb, the wheels locked out, and I didn't, I wasn't even going quick, it was just a very sharp corner, but I didn't judge properly because of how dark it was. Number five, Sleepy Molly. Sleepy Molly gets into a pretty sticky situation. He was recording a video with his friends Laser Beam and Anything for Views, and they had an insane idea of them dining inside a truck, and it almost ends really bad because Sleepy Moly gets banged up. Video. Child! Ready? You right? You right? Chad, that was too much, bro. I was, I hit the wall so hard that I, I hit my head, got concussion. I broke my collarbone. I bruised my ribs. I was winded. That's why I was, you could hear me going, because I couldn't breathe. And the other thing is too, is remember how I said Dose over, took over for Lana? That's because Josh flew into Alana and she ended up breaking her leg and having surgery. So it actually was real bad what happened. <laughs> okay, oh, it froze. <laughs> Chad, that was too much. Yeah, you right? I stop, stop, I can't. All right. Wait, wait, stop. Number four, SS Sniper Wolf. This one here is insane because Sniper Wolf gets into a really weird accident. She was a complete stop at a red light and someone just ended up going and ramming into the side of her. The police showed up and it's a really big deal. Thankfully though, she did end up being okay and the only thing that was damaged was her car. And that's important because you always can buy a new car, but you can't buy a new self. So I'm glad she's okay. Actually, very fortunate that I am still here and able to make this video. My car was not so fortunate. But anyways, I'll tell you guys the whole story about what happened. We actually got hit by a drunk driver and I had my seatbelt on. I probably would have died if I didn't have my seatbelt on. I know I would have like flew out the window or something. I, the first thing I did was take pictures of everything, call my mom. 
I did a little commentary thing video here. This guy just crashed us at a light. He's still in the f***ing car. He's like drunk or asleep or I don't know what. Look what the f*** happened to my car. I was sitting at- Number three, Dan TDM. Dan TDM actually going and ended up hurting his hand. He ended up going to the doctor, well, the hospital to get x-rays. And what he ends up finding out wrong with his hand is absolutely insane. You guys have to see this. Awesome. Two and a half hour wait. Oh man. Go have an X right now. Where am I going? <laughs> um, no, that's not the way. <laughs> okay, X ray is done. Now I need to find out what I've actually done to my finger. <laughs> Okay, you guys, so it turns out that Dan literally broke his hand. He is now all up in a splint and a cast and everything. And he's sitting there and he actually goes and tells exactly what happened. You guys gotta see this. Man, people can get hurt in the weirdest ways. I have broken my hand. Um, I couldn't feel much, obviously, in a hospital. It's kind of weird, but um, I'll explain more when I get home. But this is not good news. What is wrong with me? <laughs> okay, story time with me. So sorry if the camera is shaky, by the way. I'm holding it with my left hand because obviously I can't really do much with the other one. Um, yeah, it's a little bit shaky right now, but forgive me. So I need to explain what's been going on. Basically, I was just chilling in my kitchen, walking um, from over there, right there, to over here, which is where my garden is, and I tripped, okay? I tripped, uh, well, I kind of like... I don't even know, I can't really remember that much, but I kind of spun around and I went to like put my arm out to just try and save myself from falling over and instead I whack my arm up to, well I whack my hand on like the edge of the- Number two, Stoked Kush. Stoked Kush ends up getting into a sticky situation while he was on his jet ski. He was on vacation in the Maldives with his wife and they were riding a jet ski when things took a turn for the worst and they had a weird situation. They barely, barely, barely got out of this and you gotta see what happens. Eventually, she took a very sharp turn at a high speed, which led to this. Number one, Unspeakable. Unspeakable and his friends were actually doing a blindfolded pillow fight. As you might expect, it backfired because Unspeakable he got absolutely rocked by the pillow. He fell to the floor, and this is not good. Okay, you guys, right now Unspeakable gets hit again and it is not good, you guys. Oh no, I hope Unspeakable's okay. Are you okay? You okay, man? Yeah, I'm dizzy. <laughs> Dude, that last one that you hit me with was, I think it was your hand. No. I, I think it was. Dude, <laughs> this is like, this was it like... Ew. Well, there you have it, you guys. If you enjoyed today's video, drop a like, subscribe, and press on more videos you see on the screen right now to watch more videos just like this one. And I'll see you guys over in those videos.